Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. Happy Catty Crypto here. So another late night update, recording this for you folks. It's just going to be a short one, nothing really big for you folks in the morning. I'm still just going to start doing them as short videos. Whatever revenue we earn, we earn. Um, I'm getting bored of pretty much doing eight minute videos and trying to provide as much factual content for people as possible with the majority of people just calling it FUD or just not wanting to accept that these are the things that have been said. These are the things that have been stated and they're still unhappy with it. I mean, you're more than welcome to go over to the Wolf of YouTube channel, grab a big bag of hopium from over there. Uh, I'm pretty sure he's got plenty of it for you folks, but I have got some good news and it's some really good news because I mean, is Zada saying this? So someone's asked him, are there any validators who have agreed to implement the new update? And Zardar has responded saying approximately 40% have indicated they will take the new update. If they actually will take actually if they will actually take it remains to be seen. Um, so really good news there. And then obviously ending it with it could happen or it couldn't happen, but ultimately saying that they have 40% of them on side, which is in itself really good because it looks like then the software update will get accepted there'll be a new blockchain birthed um in theory because we'll be going over to the rebel one net rebel rebel net one it's one or the other i'll take a look and um i will confirm that for you at some point but um as to this happening Really, really good to see this happening. And then also Luna Classic is also trending once again. Is it helping the price? No, not really. We've just seen a pretty large dump in my, well, not, I mean, not huge, but I mean, you're talking a 10% dump within a matter of 30 minutes. So it's pretty substantial. Um, so it seems to have um, bounced. As to what it's going to do now, we do not know. Had a lot of people message me saying, is it losing momentum and things like that? And I wouldn't say it's losing momentum. What you're seeing here is paper handed people getting shaken out. Um, people who thought it was going to be a moon overnight situation, possibly went into the Terror Rebels meeting, realized that the all of the things the YouTube has been saying are just not true and everything else is still in the test net, so to speak. Uh, it could be a whale selling out, but I would have thought it'd been a he way heavier dump than this if a whale uh, pulled out, so to speak. Uh, so as to what's responsible for this, do not know. Would I say it's momentum? No and yes, but at the same time, I can't say that for certain. But we are in a stagnation period and everybody knows that. And I mean, we have been crabbing along. It's looking really good because... Ultimately, we are still up. As you can see, we've come down before and tested down here recently and we've come back up and uh, crabbed sideways. So hopefully it's just a quick come down, quick retest, come up again and uh, start tracking sideways. So this video is coming out in the morning. So hopefully it brings some joy to your day with you seeing this whole 40% uh, of indicated that they will take the new update, which is really good. We just need to figure out about all these bad actors and things like this across the board. Uh, this coin is launching tomorrow or the day after. Um, I'm possibly going to have them on Friday's live stream. I'm, I just want to see really how this is going to go because there's like, I think there's about 10 different coins now that are coming out with this same idea and it's like really good. I get it. And, um, a lot of people are, um, shilling it, so to speak, and really, really doing good coverage on it. But at the same time, it's like, do we really need another coin to burn a coin? Why don't we just spend the money we're going to buy that coin? I just, it's a bit confusing. And then ultimately I always ask myself a question with these coins. What can I do with it afterwards? Like, what do I do after I've bought it? Do I just sit on it and hold it? What's going to drive the price up? Um, so yeah, we'll have to see how much they sell in their pre-sales. I think it's up to like 250 K, which means that they'll be burning I don't know, something crazy. Or was it 250 mil? Uh, unsure. I'll get back to you on that one. But yeah, this is launching very, very soon. Matthew Perry's been covering this quite a lot. Um, I haven't really done any coverage on it whatsoever. But yeah, it's there. It is happening. Once they launch, they do a burn. We can sort of grasp how they're getting on with it. As to coining, um, they are still burning. 
So if we get coining up, they are still burning. It is very, very small, but they're getting a lot of good feedback um, on their burns every time, even them, with them being this much. I mean, I'm putting out a tweet these days about burning uh, £830 worth of um, Luna Classic uh, this month and struggling to get like 50, 50 likes on a tweet now, which is um, really sucky and really strange when you've got 12.9k followers and you're struggling to crack um, anything. So, yeah, really interesting. We're definitely under attack by this other group. It's sad to say I hate drama, but we are under attack nonetheless. Um, I've had to block a lot of people that have just been absolutely just disgustingly horrible to me because of I wouldn't publicise all of their drama stuff to do with terror rebels terror rebels are completely ignoring it and allowing their shit storms storm so to speak just absolutely um tear through me and because they don't address it they just look like the good people all the time and i'll always cover the good side of their work and i'll always cover the negative side of the work and that's just how things work for me i'm a neutral party these are the things that i do so yeah uh lunkdale still burning really really highly underrated burning person and yeah Folks, have a really nice day and um, stay safe, trade safe. Beware of scammers. I'll catch you in the next one. Shh.